Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about factoring quadratic expressions. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, p squared minus 5p minus 14, and we have to factor this completely. I look at my a value, it's 1, so it's pretty standard here. With that, I look at my c value, which is a negative 14. So I had to ask myself what two numbers multiplying to be a negative 14, and I really just focus on the positive 14, so it's like 1 and 14, and well, 2 and 7. But since it's a negative 14, I know one of these numbers will have to be negative of a pair. Now I have to ask myself the second question, what two numbers add here with some combination, one of them being negative, to be a negative 5, okay? And that is actually with 2 and 7. 2 plus a negative 7 equals a negative 5. And so those are, the, those are the numbers that I'm looking for here. So I'm going to set this up in my standard factored form, with the p's here on the end, b multiply. And then I have to use my combination here. I have a positive 2 and a minus 7, and we've actually factored this. All right, our final factored answer now is just p plus 2 times p minus 7. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.